there will be no fighting climate change without raw materials. There will be no batteries. There will be no windmills. There will be no solar panels. The dilemma that needs to be managed is how to do mining in a way that we can defend and where we focus not only on fighting climate change, but also fighting the loss of biodiversity. One dilemma is that not every member state would have the fiscal space to support their industry. We cannot rely on state aid to develop Europe because then Europe will develop in, in not just in two speeds, but in many different speeds. What is important for us is that there is legitimacy also in mining investment. And legitimacy is supported by transparency. But I don't think that it necessarily will have to come through the European Commission. The European Commission is a huge bureaucracy. It's not a bank. The second thing is that mining in Europe is, is not enough for the needs. We need to get materials from outside of Europe and of course we need to recycle in a completely different manner compared to what we do today. So we need a European approach uh, to all of this because I think it can only be justified uh, to mine outside of Europe if you do it the same way as you would mine inside of Europe. Which means that you need to change how you see the value change so that the resource-rich countries get, you know, a, their part of the value chain. It is their raw material, it's not ours. And having seen, for instance, copper mining uh, also in, uh, in Chile, the effort that it takes to get the copper, we should be ashamed of ourselves if we do not reuse it over and over and over and over again because these are precious materials and the effort that it takes to get it from the planet is enormous.